guys, this is Feeding Frenzy 91 and I'm talking about this email, right? Now, if you guys don't know, the Microsoft and FTC trial is going on, basically about Microsoft trying to acquire Activision Blizzard, and they had to release a bunch of stuff, and they released an email from 2019 from Matt Booty to Tim Stewart. Okay, I'm not going to read the whole email, but in the email, he does point out basically that they're in a very unique position to be able to go spend Sony out of business. Now, I'm not sure if he meant that literally. And guys, I'm not taking a side here. I'm just going to say that now. I understand that sometimes my biases do get in the way probably of when I'm doing the of objectivity, I guess. But guys, whether you're for Microsoft's acquisition or not, just be honest here, please. Let's just try, let's just try to be honest here, I'm going to say. Because does this email really prove that Microsoft is trying to buy Sony out of business? Now, let me explain honestly. If this email was a statement by Microsoft, yes, it would. But this is from Matt Booty to Sim Stewart. This, there's no evidence as far as I know that they actually, Microsoft that is, went along with this and said, this is the plan we're going to do. There's no evidence with that. So I got to be honest, and I'm not sure if this is going to be the nail in the coffin that some people think it's going to be and not cause, or at least cause them to not be able to buy Activision Blizzard. I'm just saying because this is Matt Booty basically making this, I don't, I don't want to call it a suggestion, but he's basically telling them what position they're in. And like at the end, he points out that Sony's basically the only competition for Game Pass. Yeah, he, he ain't even mentioned Nintendo. Like Nintendo is really the child playing without a care in the world, basically, while Sony and Microsoft are busy trying to one-up each other, okay? Um, not perfectly, but you guys get what I mean, right? Like, these two are competitors. Sony does anti-consumer things. Microsoft does anti-consumer things. So whether or not this crosses the line, well, I don't know whether Sony actually accepted his idea because this is just him sending an email to Tim Stewart. So I can't really say that this is proof that Microsoft is trying to spend Sony out of business. They're competitors. They try to one-up each other. So I just got to be honest. I can't say this is the nail in the coffin in this trial. But what do you guys think? Do you guys think this letter is the nail in the coffin for the trial? Or do you guys think that there's still a chance that Microsoft may acquire Activision Blizzard even after this letter? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. And may God bless you all.